But I'm a purist. Shoulders. That's strong right there. More trap than shoulder. Both right, both beautiful. Make love to the weight, don't just have sex. See the difference? Those two change ups. And you know I hate supersets, but just it throwing really those does. two together with a little break in between, the overload on that, the isolation on that. The overload? I was going heavier. Oh, okay. Yeah, I was doing it right. I see. <laughs> no one wants those shots. Yeah. yeah. What? Do you know Marcellus Wall? So obviously the weight's different between the behind and the front. What else is different about that? Uh, the extreme range of motion is the main thing. Back here is a lot so far back in between, behind here. So you're here, but the front one is out here. So range of motion, um, man, I love, I love going in between the two because you really, they're both side laterals, cables, but you so feel the difference on the muscularity that's working with the connection going all the way through the body. So for, for you specifically, what does that mean? Does that mean like, oh, like the side of my delt feels a little better here or is it deeper than that? With me, the first thing is, uh, can I do it in range of motion and how does it feel on the shoulder itself? Right. And then that's confirmed that it feels incredibly healthy. And then the second is, what muscles is it working? Um, and then the third is, what kind of pump is it? That's not, I don't think I've heard that word used in a set. Oh yeah, this feels healthy. This feels healthy. It's usually, oh yeah, that felt, I felt the pump. Oh yeah, I felt, I felt I was the hoping that most of the stuff I talk about, that that was a given. Right. And I don't need to prelude every video, video with saying, this feels healthy. Right. But I'll put that on this, this, I'll put that on a disclaimer from now on. Healthy, feels good, you know, I thought again. And not heavy enough. And not heavy enough. That's a, it's important to think about that though, because they're... Why wouldn't that be the first thing? I mean, I always tell my clients, if it feels wrong, it probably is. But, but that, that's two different things, because they're gonna go, well, if it, then wrong is, 
it's still healthy. You're right. It, it, it's yeah. still healthy. Wrong is just the body not understanding the, the range of motion and, and the uh, angles that you're going. But yeah, yeah it would be hard to decide. Yeah. That. That's a great point, though. It is. So the, the two biggest differences that he said, if it feels wrong or different, right? Well, yeah, but that's the thing. A lot of times, as you're first learning something, it will feel wrong, and so that doesn't really work. That's a learned thing. You have to know your body mechanics. But healthy, I think healthy is, I mean, for me, after 30, I started realizing, okay, this feels healthy and tough. Yeah, yeah. And I like that, right? Yeah, healthy right. Yeah. and tough. Um, so that bar embodies healthy and tough, the bar we use. That, that really embodies that idea. You know, as opposed to a 400 pound shoulder press, which is going to feel tough and probably not all that healthy. You're banging yourself up and down, whereas that there's no impact on the tilt. And you still get the full effect. What do you weigh right now? Me? Yeah. I weigh 302 pounds. <laughs> hey. Jeez. Just keep Yeah. That is a large individual. It's a lot of food. But we eat it. So somebody the other day goes, and this, again, it's funny because me and my guys all laugh at it. Uh, he goes, oh, you're a 230 on gladiators. And I'm like, you can just say things to say things. Yeah. <laughs> I haven't been 230 since I was 14 years old. But I think they don't realize that bodybuilding, they really don't comprehend this. Bodybuilding is an illusion. Absolutely, yeah, they If don't. I put a photo of you up and put a photo of the kid that took second in the uh, uh, classic bodybuilding, I don't know his name. Kid that took second. Keon? Beautiful body. Keon? I don't know. Lunchford, Derek Lunchford, the one that's all big now? No, no, uh, classic bodybuilder, Mr. Olympia. Oh. But but he has a beautiful body. But anyways, he has a beautiful body. And I bet you if you showed an individual and go, who's heavier, they would go him. Probably, yeah, probably a lot of times. And they don't realize he's maybe, I don't know what he is, maybe 180, 190 pounds, I don't know. Where you're over 300 pounds. Yeah. It's like such an illusion that people don't comprehend that. No, they really don't. And I think they only calculate body weight mentally from the waist up. You know, so they forget there's good legs on body weight. You know, cover that and you cover athleticism. That, that's real. That's different muscle altogether than just puffed up. Are they also going off of what they weigh? Probably. Yeah. You know, if they, if, if, I'm a big guy. I'm 200 pounds. <laughs> no. <laughs> there's a perspective shift for sure. September 24th through the 26th, the Titan Workshop, Arkansas. Um, we're gonna have a link up for you guys so you guys can register. Unfortunately, you're gonna have to register for this because this is gonna be a sold out event. Um, but I have some celebrities coming in, some incredible trainers. It is gonna be a magnificent weekend of health and fitness, knowledge, um, and outside information for business, uh, entrepreneurs, well, I said that in one take. Look at that. But uh, today's shoulder workout, I hope you guys enjoyed this. This is a lot of knowledge. I imagine this video might be split up into a couple uh, videos. But let me know what you guys see, what you don't understand, and what you did understand. I would love to hear that because I really, I'm cool with you guys going, I don't understand it. Um, and so if we can explain it better for you. And remember, we're editing this video, so maybe something's cut out that actually should be in there. Um, never. never, never. But I've never maybe the, video I'm off. leaving something out. Doug always leaves something out. Yeah, um, it's hard to get these guys to talk. Yeah, that's the good. Enjoy the day, have a good one, guys.